that you will order mm. yes mm. okay balance. <clears throat> yeah so for ballast is now uh balance. ballast is uh volume again times three Uh, volume then three is now the Sorry. conversion factor to get the quantity I mean for you to get the number of uh, tons yes class of uh, yeah, so if you want the number of lorries, then you just divide by uh, divide by 18 so that you get the number of uh, lorries that you will order to get uh, for that given works. Mm. Mm. Yes, yes. I I measure. So for the I next am. class of uh, concrete, uh, for example, here is a uh, class 20. <laughs> yeah we'll do the same approach but then now here here for every cubic meter is uh, five bags of cement yeah this is a uh, please note that this is a uh, class 20 and uh, these factors depending on how the depending on uh, your rationing or how, how how that given uh, mixing is done so it can always be having an error of uh, plus or minus one so if someone tells you that instead of five let's use six that should just be okay but then for this case we're just going to do uh, five bags of five bags of uh, cement so an error of uh, plus or minus one should just work just fine yeah so you get uh, uh yeah, you get uh, for this case you get uh, cubic five. meters times five you get the number of bags of uh, bags of cement uh -huh. yeah so once you have your cement mm -hmm. then we talk about uh, sand sand in this case now we go we use uh, volume times uh, one point one point four Now the conversion factor here for every cubic meter is uh, 1.4. Okay. Yes. So 1.4 times a cubic meter. Then uh, divide by the capacity of your lorry so that you have the number of trips that uh, you are going to order for the sand. Mm -hmm. Yes, then uh, for ballast, you do it uh, times uh, 2.5. Okay, this, yeah, this is uh, based on uh, accumulative experience on how you keep uh, you keep working and then you keep uh, you compare with uh, your colleagues as time goes then you now have a conversion factor uh -huh. that you use to convert because you yeah. realize that not in every site you'll have those uh, uh, sophisticated calculations of density and so on and so forth so instead there is a summary uh -huh. there's a summary that you'll only come up and you'll also ascertain uh -huh. by yourself yeah. based on how your experience mm. builds up when dealing with such items so with the time you come to a conclusion that this is now the factor so these are the factors mm. that uh, in my analysis the comparison with my colleagues we've come up with to have those factors to get you uh, schedules uh, I mean uh, materials uh, quantities mm. okay. yes yes so that is uh, uh, class 30 so class, class 30, 30 for instance you will do this is a uh, this was five bags so class 30 you just add will be uh, around eight eight to ten eight to ten bags you pick any of the figures eight to ten bags 
yeah then uh, yeah i'll confirm the factors to use for this uh for this uh, conversion for sand and uh, ballast yes yeah then uh, let's do hardcore finally <coughs> Yes, so for hardcore, uh, hardcore it's also another by experience as well that uh, a lorry, 18 ton lorry would hold or uh, the capacity in terms of cubic meter would be around 9 cubic no. meters of, uh, of hardcore when it's already packed in place. Okay, okay. So I'm telling you that mm -hmm. uh, also based on the experience and uh, arrival to given factors of conversion, nine cubic meter is equivalent to the capacity of eighteen ton lorry. Mm -hmm. So, did you get that? Mm -hmm. Nine cubic meter is Nine equivalent to meter. eighteen ton lorry, the capacity of eighteen ton lorry. In other words, the eighteen ton lorry would contain nine cubic meter of hardcore when packed into position. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you'll just get mm -hmm. you'll just get uh, the volume. So of course you will measure it in uh, square meters when it's not yet uh, more than 300 uh, when it's not yet more than 300 millimeters in thickness okay? yeah. yeah so you get okay. your area times yeah. the thickness which is the area okay. times 0 0.3 you get the total mm -hmm. volume then you divide by the volume of a capacity of one uh, one lorry of uh, 18 tons then you get the number of lorries of mm -hmm. a hardcore that you will order for the works Uh, yes, uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, that is it. Uh, you are paying a parif namara. You are paying a parif namara. Pia quarry dust, you're blinding pain of a parif. Pia quarry dust, now you're blinding pain of a parif. Oh, blinding, you burst about blinding. Uh, stone dust. Mm. No, for stone dust, mm. stone dust is a factor of uh, you do the area times uh, 0 0.006. Mm -hmm. uh, the area times uh, 0 0.006. Mm -hmm. That's also another factor. So the area times 0 0.006, then you'll get the number of uh, lorries, uh, number of lorries of uh, stone dust, uh, 18 ton to, uh, uh, lorry capacity. Size is as 